Immediately after the doctor's regeneration, the master kidnapped Adric and held him in the Hadron web, using his mathematical prowess to produce his own version of block transfer computation to create Castrovalva as a trap for the doctor. However, the doctor saw through the trap and saved Adric, destroying the city and defeating the master. The TARDIS next landed on the psychodrome where Adric faced his fears of letting people down and facing a mathematical problem that he could not solve, all the while getting to know his new companions better. And served as squire to Sir Keot of Lakora. Attempting to get Tegan to Heathrow Airport, the TARDIS landed on a ship where Adric agreed with and joined Monarch before the doctor managed to change his mind. For which he was scolded by the doctor. In 1666, he helped Nyssa build a sonic booster to destroy a teraleptal android. Determined to prove himself worthy of his place in the TARDIS, Adric chose to face the Celestial Toymaker's challenges, during which the Toymaker tried to turn him against the Doctor by showing him a hallucination of Gianna and his mother and father. The hallucination reminded Adric of some of the things he had faced because of the Doctor, but Adric did not give in. In 1016, he introduced an Asian tribe to the Longbow. The deaths that would result from this concerned the doctor. He argued with Tegan whilst Nyssa was called by the master's communication node. Adric wanted to learn how to fly the TARDIS and ran a number of simulations, killing everyone aboard in each. To help, the doctor took the crew to Gallius Ultima where Adric had something of a romance with Autumn Tace. He used his mathematical ability to calculate the trajectory to pilot a satellite to deflect a crashing spaceship. When Rovus tried to possess him, Adric used mathematical sequences, such as prime numbers and the Fibonacci sequence, to concentrate his mind to stop it. After Autumn died, the doctor told Adric that he could not use time travel to undo established events. Afterwards, when the TARDIS landed at the Contingency Club he was intrigued at what happened in there. Escaping with Marjorie Stonegood, they discovered an underground bathhouse on their way back to the surface. He helped the doctor escape from the Red Queen but was captured himself. He decided to start reading all the books on vampires once he finished all the maths books. Tegan asked him to pilot the TARDIS back to Heathrow, but something went wrong and he disappeared from the console room. He landed on a ship and pretended to be Perot to get information. He was was captured by Gavadin but later escaped and told the doctor that there was something wrong with the trajectory of the meteor. In 1920s England, Adric fought the master once again and met Harry Houdini. Tegan confided in him that she had begun to enjoy traveling in the TARDIS. He pretended to be an assassin contracted to stop the Scorpion. He searched through a set of catacombs with Nyssa where they were attacked by a mysterious force. After being flung into the future, he was trialed for stealing some bread and sentenced to death. The Brotherhood of Sabo was interested with him. The doctor and Nyssa saved him from being hanged. He helped to solve a murder on Argentia, which he watched one of them happen later being rescued by multiple doctors. Adric believed the girls were a hindrance to his relationship with the doctor and had a clear preference for the fourth doctor. An IXOS4. When the crew visited Cranley, Adric briefly met and flirted with Ace, who was looking for one of the segments of the key to time. She threatened to give him a permanent limp if he continued. At Cranley Hall, he dressed up as a pirate but refused to dance. On one occasion, Adric, the Doctor, Nyssa and Tegan spent Christmas with the renegade time Lady Iris Wild Time, who was fond of him. On another occasion, Adric used block transfer computation to make a cake for Christmas dinner. The crew also celebrated Freedom Day on Lemuria. On battlefield, Adric was stabbed in the chest but survived due to his heart being on the other side of his chest. He and Nyssa attempted to fly the TARDIS and landed on Fleming's Island where the crew faced the Eye Predator with which Adric was able to find a way to communicate. After grumbling to Nyssa during a chess game, he wandered out onto a planet of statues where he started to become one of them. The doctor saved him, much to his annoyance, and Nyssa made him promise that he would wait a few months before he asked to return. Adric agreed, 